actually look like we're going to see the Falcon at all from Fatality. Very smart move. This matchup was garbage in Brawl, uh, Smash 4, and it remains pretty difficult. I think you know, Pikachu's only gotten better, and Falcon's only gotten worse. So, um, also props to Fatality with the Black Lives Matter tag. I think he just had a, a regular name on his Switch in the last tournament, so uh, which was like his first Wi-Fi tournament. So now that he realized like, he could change it, he's like, hey, let's uh, show some more support. Yeah, definitely. I know Fatality is one of those people that have been going to focus, so great kudos to him for doing that in front of yeah. him. But yeah. hey, this talks are not great right now. You can yeah. play, play this matchup a fair amount in front of Yeah, I think just having a Mario on hand as a talking player is good. It covers a lot of those matchups where you know you either get really exploited off stage or comboed to pieces. Mario's got a great recovery as well as a good combo breaker, two good combo breakers, up B and neutral air. Um, that said, it looks like Sam is just too used to fighting these pocket Marios. I know uh, Fatality is quite good in practice. He even uh, had that one crazy tournament set against Void in Smash 4 with the yeah. Mario. Um, but yeah, like Ace Time just making short work of two stocks. Oh, missing the combo right there, but still nonetheless, getting the up here. Mario a lot harder to combo than Captain Falcon. Ace Time, of course, knows that, but you saw him fall out of the combo right there, get another chance. But you see, man, he's just all over him, even poking through the stage. This guy's just, oh, the oh my god. Here! Yeah, that's an ESAM classic. I've actually played on my Wi-Fi in Smash 4 with Mario because I didn't want to find him Falcon, and he did that to me a whole bunch. Wow. That seems yeah. so crazy. You saw him uh, catch him off guard with that twice. The first time, Fatality was pressing Nair, probably because he was expecting to get to the ledge and maybe do get up attack or like a ledge hop aerial. But then the second time around, he just sunk. There was no shot of redemption for that and jumped less off the stage, of course. Yeah. Definitely not the move. All right, so do you think he's staying the Mario? Uh, I don't know. It's a really good question, to be honest, because like the same thing could have happened to Falcon times 10, you know? So just like on paper, it's the smart call. Even if you got bodied, just have some faith in the counter pick. But I wouldn't doubt that with his back to the wall, it seems pretty tempting to go his best character, even if the odds are against him. Yeah, because Mar cause though his Mario is Mario's a good counter pick, his Mario's probably not as practiced as the Falcon. Right. So it's not going to probably be up to par. And Esam, so yeah, there we go, playing Falcon. All right, so where are we going? Yeah, let's see what the stage pick is here. All right, it's going to be Smashville. And I, I think this is just like pretty neutral for both of them. I, I don't see off rip a key advantage that Falcon gains here. It's just really rough for him in this matchup no matter what. But if Fatality feels comfortable here, then that's enough for it to be a good counter pick. And yeah. so far he's doing... Uh, oh! He's doing something. <laughs> I don't know what either of them are doing, if I'm being completely honest with you, Chiefski. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're taking each other's stocks. Yeah. Uh, but we saw the I'll be out of shield, and it's going to miss um, Esam right there because Pikachu is such a short character. It's definitely one of the hardest moves. But like, he's catching it right there. It's just hard to hit this character, and especially as Captain Falcon. Characters like We Fit Trainer also have a really hard time with it. Wow, dragged all the way out. He died to that. 65 before they hit on fair. Good lord, that move is a lot stronger than it used to be, too. Yeah. He said I'm laughing that like every single day. So it's crazy that we've seen it right here. You see the hard work there and all. I like how Esam recovered to the stage, so he didn't even have to deal with being on the ledge, but wow, a savage dunk and literally one minute and five seconds to kill Fatality three times. They I mean and they even traded stocks the first time. So it was just like a two stock match straight up and Esam destroyed him. Yeah. Jesus. And I mean you see why Falcon suffers in this matchup, right? It's just hard to hit the character. Off stage, you get bodied. On stage, you get comboed. And also, he's got a good projectile and he's quick, so it's hard to pin him down and catch him. Like, ah, oh, man, such a tough time for Captain Falcon, but props for uh, trying to fatality for sure. Yeah. All right. 
And I think we have the winner for any of our top eight. Ready? Yes, we do. The Buzz versus Fatality. Uh, and then on the other side, it is 8-Bit Man versus Sharp. So that's pretty cool, man. We got two players uh, who were like, you know, top 15 PGR in Smash 4. And then two players who I don't believe 8-Bit Man was PGR at any point in Smash 4. He may have been. No, I um, think he was Area 